858. Well, this fool said he's out this bitch. He's not gonna stick around. Or I guess he's parking. I don't recognize him. He's tall as fuck too. I'd recognize somebody that tall. I usually don't uh, film medical emergencies, but uh, I've seen quite a few officers show up already, so. It's about the only time I go in there. Take Vidya. I think the fireman is asking the corporal. Uh, he's asking the who is who am I? He's like, who is that guy? She doesn't like me. But she doesn't have such a bright history either. She was the one busted in that sky high raid. Talking down on an old lady in a wheelchair with one leg. I guess he wants to walk home. <clears throat> Not sure if he said he got knocked out the other day or he got knocked out before the cops showed up. So there's a gentleman behind me in his car who's recording with his phone and that's what they're staring at they're not staring at me they're staring at a uh, the gentleman behind me who's taking video one thing I've noticed that whenever me or Santa and audits goes out to these communities and uh, a crowd gathers or whatever and they see us filming you know getting all nice and close or whatever the usually the community members themselves start pulling their phones out and they start recording themselves which is pretty cool to see. I have a feeling most people in this city believe that uh, it's illegal to film the cops. So they're offering to take the dog to his house if, if he decides to take the ride to the hospital. Like I said, guys, I don't usually get all up at close and personal when filming uh, medical incidents. I understand I can. 
But I'll be honest, I wouldn't want to be filmed in a medical incident. Like, all up close, that is. You know, up close and freaking personal, as, as close as they are, I guess, is what I'm trying to get at, but... I usually don't even, I, I, there's a lot of medical, uh, incidents that happen in this city. I don't, I don't, I don't usually go to them just because it's, you know, it's usually somebody who's just suffering from something. I'll stick around only if there's, uh, plenty of officers on hand, on scene, or if it's an officer I know is a dirtbag, I'll definitely stick around. But... If this makes it to the cutting room floor, then it does. If it doesn't, then it doesn't. But it's a dope dog. Man, they better take that dog home. They're gonna just ditch it or take it to the pound. That's good though. He's uh, taking the ride to the hospital. He definitely didn't seem too hot. Now that he's gone, I guess we can get a little closer, huh? Let's see who takes him home. dog is scared. I mean, they shouldn't surround it. It's already scared as it is. Just grab it. Jesus Christ. That's cool. The dog jumped in on its own. That's awesome. Well, they got some help, but it showed initiative to get in the car. That's cool. The dog got a happy ending, yo. The dog got a happy ending. I wonder if they think I'm with the guy taking video out of his car. Dude's probably gonna get tailed after this and shit. <laughs> I gotta let them leave so I can catch up to them in my car. Because if they see me and my get in my car, they're gonna they're gonna run from me and they're gonna speed. They're going to speed. They're going to run lights just to get away from me. I'm going to go into the liquor store and see uh, 